positive and this is a video on E3 2015, what I found was good, what I thought about it and the games that are coming out this year and next year that I like and also uh, for some of you who didn't watch it this will be new information or probably if you're watching this and you're a games fan as me you will know most of the stuff I'm about to tell you but this is just my thoughts and opinions on it. Uh, one of the biggest surprises for me, and the surprises for a lot of people, was a game called The Last Guardian was finally announced. Most of you uh, probably won't know what The Last Guardian is, but a lot of people do know what The Last Guardian is. Guardian is sorry. The Last Guardian is a game from the makers of the Ico and the Shadow of the Colossus game for the PlayStation 2, which also got a HD remix on the PS3. Now, this game was first shown back in 2006-2008, round about then, and they showed a little trailer, but nothing really was heard from it again. Now, IGN, a couple of weeks, months ago, uh, apologised for releasing a statement that the game had been cancelled, uh, in fact, which in actual fact, uh, it hadn't, because one of the Sony executives tweeted on Twitter that he was laughing about about it with the producer over dinner and that the game wasn't cancelled it was just in development there's been a couple of problems uh, during development people leaving and such but this year they finally released it and they finally released uh, a release date for the game which is 2016 uh, I myself am happy about that the game looks good although I haven't played the Ico and the Shadow of the Colossus games uh, one of the other big things that Sony announced was Shenmue 3 Kickstarter. Now, the producer uh, was in the trailer talking about the game and produced a Kickstarter. Now, for those of you who don't know what a Kickstarter is, basically a Kickstarter is when they advertise like a game or something that's coming out, but they need money in which to produce it. Now the original goal was $2 million, but that was for a basic game, basic setup kind of thing, a digital version. But if they got more money, they would add more stuff into the game, like uh, mini games that was in the original, or other stuff like that. Uh, you, if you go on the Kickstarter, which I will put a link in the description to the Shenmue 3 Kickstarter, then go and have a look on there, it will tell you all the information about it. And if they hit certain goals, what will be added into the game. Now, I myself am not a big fan of Shenmue. I haven't played the game, so that wouldn't make me a fan. But I did watch uh, nearly a full playthrough of Shenmue 1. So if you haven't played the games, uh, go and check that out. That'd be uh, appreciated to the fans of the game. Something else uh, that was announced was from Microsoft which was uh, Dark Souls 3. Me and my cousin was talking about this in the UK the morning before because the conference was in the morning in America but on the night in uh, the UK. We was talking about what happened if there was another Dark Souls game and lo, old, lo and behold they released a Dark Souls 3 trailer. Now that is all good. We don't know exact release dates next year sometime. So there isn't much to say unless you uh, watch the Dark Souls 3 trailer. Um, now, Microsoft uh, announced Gears of War 4 and Doom. And the game Doom, which Doom is a remake of the classic Doom. Now, if you've got uh, the game Wolfenstein, not the uh, last one, the one before that, then um, there is a beta code in that that if you signed up for, you will get beta access. I did myself. It was the uh, special uh, edition. I think it was Wolfenstein, the new order, or something like that. Uh, it was out around about the same time as uh, UFC uh, when that first came out. And uh, yeah, uh, the other thing is to say about uh, is EA released uh, FIFA 15, FIFA 16, sorry, NBA uh, 16, NHL 16, and 
NFL 16. Now FIFA 16, as you all know, is going to feature women in, in the uh, game. National teams only, not clubs or in Ultimate Team. But it's nice to see that they are recognising the women's game as something popular that they will want to put into their games. I myself buy FIFA every year on release, even though it's basically the same game, I just like the game uh, for Ultimate Team and the like. So if you want to uh, check out more about FIFA 16, check it on Google, check the trailers that's come out, because there are a couple of trailers, and you can already uh, pre-order the game, I think, on the Xbox One, because there's a link to it. And that's for that. Uh, on to Nintendo's uh, press conference, they released uh, Mario Maker, which is basically where you make your own Mario game from scratch in a variety of different uh, scales and visuals. Uh, the old 16-bit graphics, the 3D one, and it looks very good. You make your own course makers. Uh, I did have a Nintendo Wii U, but I got rid of it, so I myself won't be picking up that game. But for all Nintendo and Mario fans, that is something that you're interested in, <coughs> then you can uh, check that out as well. Um, other other things that was announced uh, from general across all platforms, uh, PC, PS4, uh, Xbox One was Fallout 4 from Bethesda. This is a wild step up from Fallout 3, including new... Uh, create your own, create your own um, buildings and stuff. All the added feature. Once again, uh, if you want to go and check that out, then uh, check the trailer or check it on Google. There is a lot of information about that game. They did show uh, a lot of all, all things. And of course, we can't forget about uh, all you Star Wars fans, uh, EA and Dice Studios making uh, Star Wars Battlefront. Now they released a lot of information about this as well at the time they showed it on the press conference there was like 451,000 viewers of EA's press conference at the time and uh, this is very very good for uh, YouTube viewers and Twitch streamers because they have talked about this game last year and now this year they've talked about it and it's definitely coming out either this year I think or next year so uh, yeah if there's anything that you would uh, like to know about E3 then comment down below check Google and that like I've said check YouTube for all the trailers because I myself can't directly have them in this video because of copyright and stuff but there will be pictures uh, as you will see throughout this video and if you are up to this stage in the video then please make sure you like, rate, comment and subscribe and uh, check me out for other videos. I do FIFA videos, uh, I've done uh, updates, vlogs, talking about clans on Black Ops, uh, Call of Duty, Advanced Warfare and other stuff like that which is generally it's ju just general gaming. I'm not a FIFA YouTuber, I'm not a, just a Call of Duty YouTuber or a Black Ops or a Grand Theft Auto YouTuber. I do a mixture of games, so if you want to check me out as long as with other blogs and stuff, other videos, a film, a film that I made I put on there, it's only a little thing. But yeah, this has been uh, Positive Gaming. Please remember to like, rate, comment and subscribe. Check me out for further videos. And there will be uh, more gameplay and games coming up soon. Thank you and I'll see you on the next video.